Time now for NTV's first alert weather forecast. Not bad out there today. A little bit of shower activity rolling across the region. It will be out of the picture after midnight tonight. 66 Hastings, 66. Also in Goodland, Kansas, our Viero Cameron Grand Island. The rain is wrapping up. There are a few raindrops left on the lens of the camera with weekend shopping, getting ready for the weekend. Currently, there are a few showers left down to the south and west. 60 currently Grand Island West Northwest winds outflow winds from the storms overhead to 25. That's sustained 57% humidity. The barometer is dropping and there are those winds all associated with a trough of low pressure moving across the central part of the state at this hour. Temperatures have dropped where there is that rain down to 60. Last hour, Grand Island was at 70, 70 currently at Phillipsburg at McCook, but mainly 60s throughout the entire region at this hour. So there's the trough. There are the storms trailing all the way up into Minnesota and kind of scattered down in parts of Kansas. The very heavy, intense storms again tonight down in Texas, the Rio Grande Valley, the southern part of Texas, and then storms extend again tonight up in parts of Oklahoma. But the severity in the Longhorn State, other storm activity right up in West Virginia and the New England states. Uh, really widely scattered moisture, the eastern half of the country. So areas of low pressure remain in the region. That will give us those hit and miss chances of isolated storms. No severity anticipated with any of it. And we see that popping back in the forecast Sunday. By Monday night, the front all the way through, temperatures will drop accordingly. But later tonight, we do see partly cloudy skies, cool conditions, and then a nice warm up tomorrow. We see storms. It would be late afternoon and evening, high 74, 50, then the low tomorrow night. Those chances only about 30%. Lows tonight, 30s out west, otherwise mainly 40s. Highs tomorrow, mainly in the 70s. Looks like a great Saturday, a great weekend ahead as we hit 76 Sunday, 73 Monday. Monday night, rain, storms move in. They are likely in the forecast Tuesday and Wednesday as highs will be closer to what we should see for lows in May, but by next weekend, next Friday, we start warming back up again. If it has to rain and storm and so forth, do it uh, during the week, not the weekend. Yes. So it looks like we kind of see that trend starting this weekend. Kind of right. does, doesn't it? It's all good.